put that little. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, goodness. Just sat on my new hat. Pop. Can't decide if I like this or not. Do I look silly in it? I feel like it. I feel like it just doesn't fit me properly, but it's the new My Protein hat, so I need to wear it every now and then, you know. What's up, guys? Liam here. Welcome back to LSJ TV. I have a feel better about myself here. I have not had this in a good couple of months. I used to have it a lot when I first moved, uh, and then I just wanted to stop spending money, so I stopped buying them. Um, but this is a feel better about myself because I'm feeling slightly sorry for myself burrito. Um, I have just got back from the worst session I have ever had in my life. Um, and it started off fine, like it was a pool day. Um, and obviously my biceps been 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 not great for a little while. Um, but it's a little bit better and so I tried training pool. Made well back and biceps. So it was shit. <laughs> It was really, really shit, but it's okay, because I got a burrito. Oh, and it's a good one too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ah, oh. lovely stuff. trained for three months is essentially the situation that I'm in. It's been best part of, it's been like 10, 11 weeks, two and a half, three months since I really hurt my, my bicep like bad. People kept telling me I'd torn it, right? I didn't think it was a tear, anyway, I digress. You're not just gonna be able to, one, lift the weights that you were before, and two, feel the contraction in the same way that you did before, right? Because I've not had it checked out there's a potential that there was a tear, a sprain, or something messed up, right? And I don't know what that thing is, because um, I haven't had it looked at. So it's just a guessing game at this point, you know? <laughs> said that if you told me a month ago that I would be in the position that I am today actually being able to contract my bicep like just doing this I know that sounds ridiculous just doing this pain-free I'd have snapped your hand off you know I feel like I'm just a little bit gutted because over the past three months I was ready to get back into training get in good shape and, and train properly you know but that hasn't happened and it's just something that I've got to deal with right I'm sat here with a burrito, so I can hardly moan about my diet, you know? <laughs> oh god, it is a good one as well, to be fair, yeah. When the guy was making it, I was just like, hmm, a bit stingy portions, like, you know, but actually, it's, it's alright, so, I mean, it's alright. I went to the gym today with the goal of making the best video I have made for a while. I was like, right, I'm going to go to the gym, I'm going to have a great session, I'm going to start the video in the gym, and I'm going to finish the video in the gym. Everything else has been like a vlog lately, like I've been doing more lifestyle kind of stuff. I want a gym video. That was the goal from today, and I got there, and it just didn't happen. And I finished training about an hour ago, I've had a chat with a couple of mates, and I've had a chance to kind of reflect on why. And realistically, it is nothing to do with my bicep today. Today, I am not happy with myself. I do not feel good today, right? And that's okay. I am not happy with decisions that I've made, with things that I've done, with just things over the past however long, right? And that has affected me today, and that is, again, okay. I need to embrace that feeling, 
talk about that feeling, which is what I'm doing right now. I've spoken to my friends, and believe it or not, speaking to a camera is somewhat of an outlet for me. It is what I've done for the best part of a decade. It is what I know most, right? And so me doing this um, really does kind of help me. It's almost like a, I feel like I'm talking to someone. Um, and it does, it does help. And that might be a weird thing to kind of wrap your head around if you are not like that, which most people aren't, and that's fair enough. But it's very helpful for me. And so hopefully doing this will make me feel a lot, a lot better. And also, mm, when I went and got my burrito, I also picked up this, Radox, feel uplifted. I need to feel uplifted today, so this is why I bought this. I hope it does exactly what it says in the tin when I have my post-workout shower. Yes. So today I would like this video to be um, hopefully helpful to, I've said this for many years now, if every video that I can make or every piece of content that I put out there can even help one person feel a bit better or feel like they can talk to, to someone, whether that is opening a discussion with a friend, a family member, or you're confident enough to put it in the comment section like some people are, I, I love that, you know? I love that this channel over the years has become a place for people to do that and feel comfortable enough to do that, to share their thoughts, their feelings, their experiences. Um, and I feel like somewhat lately, people have done that less here. And that has been a, ultimately a reflection of me doing the same thing. I have shared less, I have still, made two videos a week and I've still posted my life, but I have not shared the ins and outs of what it is that I have been doing for a while now. Um, and hopefully soon, I was think, trying to think of a date in my head, but hopefully soon, um, I will just be creating what I want to create, sharing what I want to share and posting what I want to post without having to worry. That is where my head is at right now. That is why I've been so stubborn with this session today and that is what has been bogging me down. Oh my God, this burrito is getting messy now. Oh my God. One of my favorite things to eat, but you just get to the bottom of it and it's like, now what do I do with this, you know? I think I might go for a drive later. Like, just drive. Like go to the motorway and just drive for like half an hour or something. I've not done that for a while. Helps me clear the brain, you know? Going for a walk does that, but it's raining outside, so. I think I might go for a drive. Um, I'm gonna keep it short and sweet today, ladies and gentlemen. I had a shit session, I've had a shit day, but it's okay. Tomorrow is a new day, we go again. <laughs>
I need to work on as a person. Um, and I actually had someone say to me the other day like, that, that, that they strike me, that I strike them as a very self-development kind of person. They asked if I read a lot, um, which I don't. <laughs> I really, really don't. But just for a change, I'm recording. So someone has decided to commit a crime. I really don't read a lot. Um, not as much as I should. But what is going on? The whole part about the whole self-development thing. I guess I am because especially in the past like six months, um, I have really worked on me being myself and what I'm good at, what I'm bad at, focusing on those bad things and trying to turn them into the good. Do I always get that decision right? Do I always get those things right? No. But I'm learning and I am consciously trying to, to become a better person, right? Um, and me having days like this and accepting the fact that I am having a day like this and then taking a step back and going, why do I feel like this? What can I do to make it better? Is it gonna happen today? Is it gonna happen tomorrow? Is it gonna be next week or whatever? Accepting the fact that that, that, that is how I feel is part of that self-development, that self-improvement, I suppose. And me ranting to a camera for 10 minutes is also a big part of it. So if you have enjoyed this rant, um, I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. Thank you for tuning in today. Thank you for listening. If you are struggling, if you are worrying, if you are anxious, if you are whatever, my messages are always open. Thank you for supporting me over the years. I like to think that I can do the same to you guys um, as and when it's needed a little bit, you know? So thank you all. Oh God, my burrito's coming up. <laughs> and I will see you all in the next one, which I promise will be more upbeat. I, I promise. Love you guys. See you next time.